This video will guide you through understanding why startups need legal counsel when they should hire and what questions to ask when interviewing potential candidates. If you are launching a startup and considering future legal assistance, then this video is for you. Before we start, just a brief disclaimer. The following information is provided for educational purposes and in no way constitutes legal advice. For legal advice, we encourage you to consult a licensed attorney. We will cover why startups need legal counsel, when to hire startup legal counsel, and questions to ask when interviewing. We've also added a link below with information on lawyer pricing if you want to know the cost of hiring a lawyer. Now let's get started. Why Startups Need Legal Counsel Startups face unique legal challenges that make having legal counsel essential. Here are some key reasons why startups need legal counsel. 1. Compliance with laws and regulations. It is important to ensure your startup complies with federal, state, and local regulations. If you are operating in a regulated industry, this becomes even more important. 2. Intellectual property protection you will want to safeguard startup's intellectual property. This likely includes trademarks and any type of product development like source code. 3. Contract drafting and review. Startup counsel will help create and review contracts with employees, contractors, vendors, investors, and customers to protect your interests. 4. Fundraising. If you plan to raise money, you will need assistance with the legal aspects of raising capital, including investor agreements and compliance with securities laws. 5. Structuring the business. Startup counsel will often advise on the best legal structure for your business, whether it's an LLC, corporation, or partnership. Many startups incorporate a C-Corp in Delaware, but some also choose to form as a LLC. 6. Employment issues. If you plan to hire full-time employees or contractors, counsel will handle employment contracts, consulting agreements, and independent contractor agreements to make sure your business stays protected. They may also advise on any needed employment policies. And seven, website agreements. Many startups have a website and legal counsel will help you draft a compliant privacy policy and terms of service with your users. Note, there are many other things startup counsel can help with. When to hire a startup legal counsel. Timing can be crucial when it comes to hiring legal counsel for your startup. Startups can choose to engage on a per-project basis, purchase a monthly set of hours, or hire counsel full-time. Here are some key moments to consider. 1. Formation stage. When you are setting up your business entity and need advice on the best structure, it may be wise to engage startup counsel. This can likely be done on a project basis. 2. Intellectual property development. When you start developing products or services that need protection, this may be a good time to consult legal counsel to make sure your products or services are compliant and your agreements with customers are legally sound. This can also be done on a project basis. 3. Fundraising. When you are preparing to raise funds from investors and need help with legal documentation. This is a great time to engage startup counsel that specializes in fundraising so they can coach you on normal terms and make sure you structure deals that are beneficial for the company. Note, fundraising may be an ongoing process, so working out a deal for monthly support may be the most cost effective. Four, hiring employees. When you begin hiring employees and need to draft employment agreements and policies. Employment is a highly disputed area, so making sure your company is protected is important. Or five, entering contracts. If your deal flow picks up and start to routinely need contract review, this may be an opportune time to engage counsel on a regular basis. Questions to ask when interviewing. Choosing the right legal counsel is critical for your startup success. Here are some important questions to ask. One, what is your experience with startups? Ensure the lawyer has experience working with startups and understands the unique challenges they face. If the lawyer has experience within your industry, even better. Two, what is your area of expertise? Verify that the lawyer's expertise aligns with your specific needs, such as intellectual property, fundraising, or employment law. You can find legal counsel familiar with all issues, but sometimes it is better to engage a specialist on a project basis. Three, can you provide references from other startups? Ask for references to gauge the lawyer's reputation and effectiveness. Four, what is your fee structure? 
Understand how the lawyer charges for their services, whether it's hourly, flat fee, or a retainer. Many lawyers now provide startup legal packages, which involves a set monthly payment for a certain amount of work, which is typically discounted from their normal hourly rate. Five, what is your availability and response time? Confirm the lawyer's availability and how quickly they can respond to your needs. Many lawyers have a lot of clients, so you want to make sure they have the bandwidth for your work. Six, can you help with fundraising and investor relations? Ensure the lawyer can assist with legal aspects of raising capital and dealing with investors. This is somewhat of a specialist area, so getting someone with this expertise is important. And seven, do you offer ongoing legal support? Determine if the lawyer can provide ongoing support as your startup grows and evolves. Hiring the right legal counsel is essential for navigating the complexities of starting and growing a business. If you need help from an experienced lawyer, feel free to search Contracts Council or visit contractscouncil.com and post a job to get quotes from lawyers to help you. Thanks for watching.